Alright, so get ready to pour this this morning. Supposed to pump it. Pump guy didn't, is not here yet, but he's on the way, so he's late. So we're just gonna tailgate this first truck so we can get him out of here and get him back. Uh, and then hopefully the pump guy shows up and we can pump the rest. Concrete was for seven, and the pump guy thought it was for 7:30. We're just gonna, make, we'll make it work. Take a look at it. Pretty cold. Maybe ten more, please. Well, at least the access was good enough so we could we can dump this truck out anyway and get him back. You know, just hopefully he shows up so we can get the other truck dumped out. Probably you're good. Thank you. A little bit high. We gotta move our trucks, you think, and get him over there? Yeah, I'll go move our trucks, Javi, and get him over there. Actually, I probably only need to move this one. Okie dokie. How you been? You been good? Steady. Yeah. You out of top some all the time now? Or? A bit, please. Hi. How you doing? Can you back him up as far as you think is safe? Yeah. One more little one, then put the shoot on. He's got to be about out. Let me ask him to move or? Okay, yeah, I'll get him forward. Hey, I should have been more clear, it's probably my fault. No, I looked at the wrong slip, 7, 7.30. Okay, we got a...
All right, so first truck's down. He went just about as far as he's supposed to. Pump showed up, which is good. Got three trucks coming. One's already here, so we'll just work our way back that way and jump out. Should be all good. He should only take a few minutes really to get ready because we're just dangle pumping, so shouldn't be too bad. Want me to get them for you? Yeah, I got them. I'm old, man. I ain't that old. I'm old too, bud. Yeah, you're 57. <laughs> Piece of cake. Pour it at the right slump. You know, we got mid range water reducer, so pour a six and a half, seven slump. It goes right back to about a four in about an hour. So that's perfect. When he primes that pump, he puts a chemical in it called Slick Willy. And we don't like to get that chemical, you know, when he first pumps it out of there, you don't, you don't like to get that chemical in the in the floor because it retards the set. So he's gonna pump a little bit of concrete out to try to flush that Slick Willy out. The Slick Willy just primes the, the pipe so the concrete doesn't get plugged in the pipe. And here it comes, here it comes. Get, That's pretty rocky. Oh, wow. Most easy on that one. You've got me on that one. Yeah, okay, just stop by pulling a little bit of wire. Then when we get ahead, just go back and stop magging. Did you hand him the reins of the pump? He asked me. Did you want to do it or did I do a good job? Whew, two down on the third fourth one fourth truck's gonna be that our first truck he had to go back and get reloaded he's probably i don't know 20 30 minute ride she can wait do you just wait let them get that and then do those two oh yeah go ahead you get one more drink Go ahead, Tia. Step over that pad and do that if you need to. Don't step, there you go. It's a little high right there, Harvey, yeah. Thank you. And, uh, now you can go down the end, okay?
This is why we like our trucks right back to back to back to back with no ways because now, you know, these three trucks will probably cure up roughly about the same time. So when you go to power trial, it'll be a nice easy power trial and be no waiting. And then this fourth truck, who knows, is it gonna, is it gonna catch up to these or is it gonna be way behind them or what? So, you know, when you pull a big floors, you just, you like your trucks right in sequence without having to wait. Unfortunately, you know, these concrete companies, they're short on drivers and they have, you know, just too much work. So sometimes it's hard to get you all the, the trucks back to back like that. They have to re-trip them and that's what they're doing in here. They're re-tripping that first truck. So hopefully it doesn't mess us up down, you know, later this afternoon, but we'll wait and see. Yeah. I, I video almost all our jobs and then I edit them down into a boat. 15 20 minutes and I post them up on YouTube and you know a lot of times out like I might narrate over the video when I get it home and just kind of try to teach people how we do it why we do things the way we do and there's no one out there really teaching the young guys how to do stuff anymore especially you know they, they they email me all the time or they'll text me and you know hey I work for a crew I'm a laborer I want to learn how to finish but my guys don't want to teach me it's like why wouldn't you want to teach like her she knows how to power trial, she can finish concrete. Why wouldn't I want to teach her to make my job easier? You know what I mean? Some of these guys, they just don't want to teach anybody anymore. So that's, I mean, I've got over 300 videos up just teaching people how to do the stuff we do. And I get a lot of people thank me for it. It's a little bit higher right here and it really thins out in this spot. Kind of high behind you, Luke. Yeah, re really high. Shut him off just for a minute. Get that tuned in. Hey. I might be able to, yeah. I think we're gonna need those like a five or six foot straight edge, okay, out of the truck. It's up by where the bull float is. Yeah, there's three of them. Isn't yeah, the probably one? one of the shorter ones. Yeah. Thank you. We are we are done with that one, yeah. Yeah. I'll do it this way. You can go down to about where them guys are standing. got enough in your hopper he can just wash out right I don't know if you want to did you want to pump any back in him or no okay okay yeah we're, we're a little bit high in here so 
Should be have plenty with you. Yeah. I'd say we got plenty down here. Where are you coming, left or right? Left, okay. Yep, I'm sorry. It's all right. Ooh, get you. Oh, stepped on. Might need that little one just for a second, Tia. Yep, thank you. Oh, the hottest part, jumping out. <laughs> you still do it without a ladder, but I can't do that anymore. <laughs> My old boss is not going to run this by hand. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we try not to do them in, in the winter sometimes we do. You need a little bit or no? Uh, I can't really You just want to come along? Well, you can put that in there. So even with the pump being about a half an hour late, the pour turned out okay. The fourth truck showed up right after, you know, not too far after the third truck, so there wasn't much of a wait there. We got it all in. Darren and Luke stayed and Power Trial finished this. They were out of here. We got done pouring about 8.30, quarter, 9 in the morning. The floor was all Power Trialed out and sawed by about 12.30, so things went really, really good. Make sure you check out this video right here that's popping up, and we'll see you on the next one, guys.